The Strangers Chapter 1. Is it a prequel? No. It is a shot-for-shot -shot remake of the first one. Just done worse and more awkwardly. Uh, this movie had terrible acting. Terrible acting. Everything was the same sequential events as the first film. They had so many hysterical moments. My audience was laughing. Your film was failing. When your lead characters are being laughed at. This bitch got punched in the face. People are giggling at it. This guy, oh my god. I, minor spoilers, not really a plot, but this guy has one of the killers at gunpoint. And the speech he gives her is so dorky and cringy. And everyone's just like, people in the audience are saying, shoot her, shoot her. But my audience was losing its mind. They're like, what are you doing? <laughs> this movie was just incredibly stupid. I went to Jeremy Johns review it and he saw it by himself. I'm like, oh man, this is one of the few times I'm glad I saw a horror film with a audience. Usually I hate seeing horror films with audiences. I like seeing it by myself. No, I like going to, like when I saw When Evil Lurks, by myself, whole theater, it's a great experience. The audience was into it. They were saying how stupid it was. I mean, as soon as it ended, the amount of people saying that was dumb was hysterical. It's called Chapter One, not because it's a prequel. It is the same exact movie you've seen before, except done worse. It's because the way it ends is hysterically cringe and it, it explains it. I was like, oh my God, no way. This is going to continue. Terrible acting. Uh... It was, it was one of those horror movies that it is so bad it's good. I would say it's that. Because I laughed so many times at how stupid these characters were. It felt like an old school, like, you fighting with a TV screen type of movie. It was you fighting with the TV screen saying, what are you doing? The entire movie. And, uh, yeah. Positives. I think there was a shot in the woods that looked kind of cool, but very stupid. Very stupid. The amount of times that these characters could have just done the right thing. The amount of times that me and my brother and my friends were saying, call 911, was, it was hysterical. It was hysterical when they decided to call 911. How late? Oh my God. So I'm going to give this movie a zero out of five. It was a trash movie. And you can tell how scared California is of, of middle America because every time two characters go for camping or anything in middle America, everyone in town is like a murderer. They're just like, staring at these city boys like what are you doing here you're not from around these parts are you and i'm like it's not how middle america is but but california is scared like liberal california they're like they're all gonna shoot us and they're all bigots <laughs> terrible movie so bad it's good though and like it is it does make you laugh so what do you think about the strangers i think the first one the real first one is a good slasher film very effective very scary very scary ending. I think the second one is half boring trash. The second half of it though is very entertaining. Some good cinematography, some cool editing choices, some cool music. Um, but overall, just half of a decent movie. And then this one is one of the worst horror films I've ever seen. It really is. It might want to be one of the worst slashers ever. So those are my thoughts. Comment down below. Let me know.